Beasley on Alan Wake. Ugh. For some reason. Are you seriously telling me that writer just took out my deputies? A thriller I supposedly wrote is coming true. The genre of the story seems to be shifting. It's turning into a horror story. I was told that Alice had been kidnapped, but that was a lie. We don't have his wife. We don't know where she is. <gasps> Eaten up by the dark presence before it attacked. Yeah, bye. The truth. Oh, this is where we learn a whole bunch of information. Shh, baby, it was just a nightmare. <laughs> Alice, you sound different. Hartman, I fell. I had to give you a sedative. Don't fight it. I... You went through another rough period. Rant, rant, rant. It's very important that you stay calm. We don't want you to have another episode. You're really hope that my clinic. the audio from my microphone doesn't cut out or act all blizzy. Triggered a mental illness. No, you're no. You lie. You're suffering from various symptoms of undifferentiated schizophrenia. <sighs> schizophrenia. It's okay, Alan. Just, Just let, let go. 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 Turn the lights off. Carry me home. Na 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 na. Isn't our friend Barry like in prison or something? And that really weird, creepy girl. I felt rough. Ugh. Hartman had bumped in me and was making me numb. Damn, Dr. Hartman. Someone oh, jeez. I'm jeez. Tear. I'm so sorry. I couldn't think. It's so bright, and the freaking. Sensitivity is off the charts. Oh, I gotta do something about that. Um, da 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 da. Ba, 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 ba. I can guarantee that you can hear what's happening upstairs. My microphone loves to be super loud. There's a little. No, it's not better. I was a prisoner here. Wait, really? Glass right there. Oh, t never mind. Good evening, hey. Alan. Are we feeling better now? I hate this camera angle still. Yeah, I see you brought your pet gorilla with you. So sure, I'm calm. I get the message loud and clear. Quite right. That's the spirit. You're being <gasps> very brave, Alan. Huh. I understand. You're confused. I would be more concerned if you weren't suspicious of me. Yeah, why why am I on the run from the cops? Now, why don't you come with me? We'll reacquaint you with my clinic and go over everything you might have forgotten. Little walk and some fresh air? Yes, it will do you good. Oh, I love fresh air. Duh, let me just follow this corridor you. is for patients. How would I walk? Aren't here right now. Jack I can tell out for a fishing trip. Oh. Except for the ones who are particularly vulnerable, of course. How do I walk? I encourage create. I, mean, I actually want to know how to walk. Um. Wait, how do I walk? Control. Okay. Activity is a part of the recovery process here at Cauldron Lake Lodge. I specialize in treating artists. I bet you do. Splendid, Alan. I honestly believe we can get this thing under control. Yeah, totally. <laughs> can I get out, please? This way, Alan. Where the fuck did you go? There you are. Huh, I got in the elevator first. Ding, 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 ding. Can I get out of here? <laughs> Look at this. Look how fucking wacky this freaking sensitivity is. Experience with you, I know I need to get right into the heart of the matter as quickly as I can after an episode. So I'm just going to say this Alice is dead. No, you're no. in a very vulnerable state until you understand and accept this. Alice, drowned. why would I? And you couldn't face that. You're suffering from hallucinations, paranoid. I don't know if I believe that. Unusual thinking. I mean, that just sounds way too depressing. A feeling that I, I could really use without some depressing stuff right now, please. So, Alice, please be alive. Constructed an elaborate fantasy scenario in yeah. which your writings are affecting reality. She is but they are. And supernatural forces of darkness are trying to stop. Be 
go this way, Alan. I, uh, I mean, I never would have shot. So I went along with it. Yeah. I had to be lying. Yeah. But under the influence of the drug he had given me, I had to fight not to believe his words. Oh. It's all in your head. You've been making it up. Apart from the tragic accident with your wife, no one has been killed. Your delusions are just a manifestation of your subconscious mind trying to protect you from... Oh, pain. dude, I totally understand. Unless we fight the fantasy, it will return. I know the instinct is to resist me, but think about it. Doesn't this make far more sense than the insane supernatural conspiracy you have concocted in your mind? It would if, you know, giant shadows weren't trying to kill me. Know this. Everything can be explained. Or, you know, the crazy guy that claimed to have kidnapped my wife. What the fuck is this? Ooh. I never get tired of this view. Very inspiring, isn't it? Cauldron Lake spread below us. I could see Mira Peak on the other side of the lake. I thought I could make out the spot where Diver's Isle had been when I arrived with Alice. Yeah. Now there was nothing but waves. Well, I want to stand. It seems there's a storm coming. Funny, I don't recall there being a mention of that in the weather forecast. Well then, I guess the weathermen are wrong. Hey, follow me. Aw, I was enjoying the nice, well, beautiful, I'm sunny day. Good news. Right now we're in control. Every time you have a relapse, it gets more and more difficult to resurface from the dark uh -huh. depths of your imagination. Not surprising, considering your profession. Imagination <laughs> what? is what you work with. Oh, okay. After all your nightmares, this should come as an immense relief to you. If it doesn't, why is that? Because I'm lying? Or because you don't want to admit that you're not well? It's very natural for you to think of me as your enemy. Yeah. It's part of the illness. I let him talk. Tartman obviously loved his own voice. His I mean, maybe. Badly inside my head. But I, can't I dug my nails into the palms of my hands to stay you focused. To Come on, let's go. Let's get inside. Come on. Let's go, Dr. Hartman. Let's get inside and get them... Let's go uh, inside. Medication. Hey there, guy. Well, here's the entrance to the office wing. That's for staff only. You were impressed what the, what the by fuck? my trophies when you first arrived here. I do love what? to hunt. The great outdoors. Man versus nature. I literally didn't notice the trophies once. I, I literally didn't notice any, any trophies. Scary, scary. Scary. What the fuck? What's with his neck? His mouth isn't opening while he's talking. Uh. Real bad dream, Mister. You should be afraid of me. Don't want yeah. to me in the night. That's for sure. Please, Emerson. Mister Wake is confused enough as it is. He doesn't need to be bombarded by your humongous, terrifying neck. Dream you have, or when you have it, Emerson. Okay, okay. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Or just yanking your chain, Emerson. We're actually making some progress with him. What the fuck is going on here? It's trash. Um, Hartman, there's, there's a little. Um, I think I know what the thumbnail for this episode is gonna be, and um, I. <laughs> what the fuck is going on here? Yeah, don't mind me. I'm just... Uh, I'm pretty sure I walked in before you did. You've been writing as a part of the therapy. As soon as you feel up to it, you should continue. Oh, that's so cute. Yeah, I knew we were gonna go in here. My rheumatism is killing me. Hey, wait a minute. Aren't those those old guys? Oh, what a storm. I hope it wipes this place off the face of the earth. Ooh, and fucking edgy right there, freaking Mr. The Hot Topic. Brothers, Odin and Tor. They had a... Oh. Odin and Tor. I'm surprised you didn't just put an H between the T and the O. Yep, look at that. Wow. They even adopted new first names to complete the image of Viking gods. After the oh my god. Up, they lived on a farm 
nearby. They are, well, in advanced stages of dementia. They're well cared for, TLC and all that. There's nothing more that can be done. Yeah. I'm afraid that the rock and roll lifestyle has left its mark. I'm sure it has. No, that won't do. Oh, I'm so no. Sorry to cut this short. For now, Alan, the power has been acting up. I'd better go check on it. Apparently now we have an echo in this room. Meanwhile, when you feel up to it, return to your room and try to write. It really is for the best. And please write a better ending for your situation, please. Like, I don't want to be the villain in this story. I'd like to bash his head in with a hammer. Oh, he'd love to fish out our secrets, but he has no clue. He's not crazy enough. <laughs> not crazy like us, Sonny. Yeah. Being crazy is Let me guess, uh, the one with the hammer is Tor? The world when it's and the one with the freaking eye patch is, uh, Odin? To no crazy. That's the sanest thing I've heard in a while. <laughs> <laughs> Say, you're all right, Tom. I knew I should have aimed for the head. Go to the farm. The Anderson farm. Valhalla. We wrote it all down, lest we forget. A crash course. All you yeah. need to know to get your head right. You need to find the message. Here, Sonny, here's something for you. Gave me a rash, but I kept it safe from these bastards. Yeah. I have no freaking clue what's going on. Or according to Hartman, I was sinking back into the fantasy. I was convinced he was lying to me. About yeah. Everything. Yep. Crazy or not, the Andersons made more sense. Typically, our patients have long-term creative problems. Uh, yeah. I, okay. Turn to my room. Okay. Da na 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 na. Yo, what up? All right, uh, where's Crazy Neck Guy? Disappear. My nightmare is the publisher people who want to make a contribution so they can say they made a contribution. And then we end up with mullets in there because they think mullets are funny. But it wasn't supposed to be about mullets. And now it's about mullets. And when it's in slow motion, they call it mullet time because the numbers came back from marketing that mullet time is the hook we needed to go big in the target demographic. And they're not even kidding. They say it all like serial killers with straight faces and smiles. My nightmare is the writers who want to make everything from the characters to the toaster. Talk, talk, talk. Okay, I think I'm done here. I think I'm done here. Where's my room? Something's wrong. I'm not myself. It's hard to think that there's a shadow inside my head. I can only focus on writing. Everything else is a blur. I'm trapped in this <laughs> Always dark outside. My editor is. <laughs> it's not human. A dark presence is wearing the old woman's face. She was covered in clinging shadows. There's a hole in her uh. where her heart should be. I think I've made a horrible mistake. I don't think I'm any closer to saving Alice. It's been lying to me, using me to get the story it wants, and the story will come true. Huh. Man, I look a lot fatter on TV than I thought. Oh, look at that. A big room just for myself. The white glare of the blank page in front of me hurt my eyes. Yeah. My hands began to shake uncontrollably. Mm. Is there's a guy behind you? Hey, wake! You stay here. I'm gonna go see what's up. You just keep doing what you're doing. Because, okay. okay. I wasn't. I wasn't going anywhere. Never mind. Now I'm going somewhere. But it could be my only chance of getting out of here. Oh yeah. Oh 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 oh. crazy brothers, are you? Not so weak now. 
Sinclair looked bad. That wasn't a love tap. The crazy old fart hit her hard. If she was one of Hartman's goons, she had it coming. What? Get the Aww. Stage is all Sinclair. yours, Tom. Seize your destiny. Hey guys, hope you don't mind if I just steal these keys. All my manuscript pages. That's where you can keep them. Oh, so what? What are we going to the staff room? What the fuck? All right then, uh, here. No. Oh, here we go. Very epic. Sure, buddy. Do you have any idea how much trouble you're in? I am famous. Oh. Barry? Ow! About time. Barry. Man, I'm glad to see you. What? What? What are you doing? Get to Hartman's office. What, what were you doing here? Door. You okay? Yeah. I mean, no. The cops found me at Rose's trailer, but they didn't hassle me too much. I'm obviously a victim in this, and I demanded to be treated as such. Okay. Or else I'd sue their asses. Yeah, that's great, buddy. That fed gave me a real hard time, but I Yeah, I, I, I'm sorry, Barry. I, I can't at the moment. I'm in the middle of something These were very all important. all the pages I had on me. And more. Yeah? Alan, please. You're sliding back into the Tell me one more lie and I'll shoot you in the face. Ooh. Ah, well, it was worth a shot. <laughs> really, Wake. Come on. Let's work together on this. You have no idea. Hartman, shut up. Barry, get out of here. I'll catch up with you. Get yeah. Car. Any car. Al, let's just go. <laughs> you know, Al, I'm very angry, but the uh... This is a mistake. Don't you see? Together we can create something absolutely wonderful with your ability and mine. Um, uh. Wow. Fuck. Poor guy. <laughs> I just killed a man. Oh, whoops. Um. Oh, oh, coffee thermos. All right, I'm good now. I had to find a way out. Yeah. Ow. Ow. <laughs> Get me out of here. Oh, okay, okay. Hold on, hold on. I just calmly open the door. Oh, Jesus, fuck. You fucking bitch. I needed light to get the possessed bookshelves out of my way. Yeah. Which means there's a flashlight in here somewhere. Or upstairs. Oh, I, I, I just gotta catch my breath. Hold on, demons. Ah, here we are. Oh, oh. Yeah. Mhm. Mm yep. Very epic. Anything over here I should take to worry about? No? Alright. Yes. Yeah! Oh! I literally jumped towards it. Oh my lord.
Yeah, son. TV gonna turn on? Ah, pick up menu script. Yeah. God. Stop it. Alright. Can I not? Oh my lord. Good now. I don't. I, I did not want to Indiana Jones my way out of this, but I did. Motherfucker. Mother trucker. Ooh, I have an idea. I have an idea. Come on. Ah! Yeah. Look at that. I'm so smart. I'm here. I, I. I don't know how to open gates. They don't teach you this in. And, 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 You're gonna have to go through the hedge maze over there. Barry, I don't have a light. Fucking kidding me. Take it. Oh god! Look at the house, Al! Look out! What? Oh. Um. Yeah. That um. That looks bad. Hey, look, there's a gate right here, too. Bye bye. I mean, yeah, I never would have guessed that, my man. Wait, is this a thing? No. Oh, I can heal myself. I'm so good. Where the fuck? Oh, I can't- I literally just cannot just climb up there? That seems pretty easy. Alright, fine. Oh no, a fucking maze. I'm not good at this. Alright, here we go. Let's get through this. Okay, I'm good now. Ah! You not sneak up on me like that. Not cool. Not cool. Oh, motherfucker. God, you're all so pathetic, like me. Ah, shit, wrong way. Oh, hey, manuscript. There you go, see? This wasn't such a waste. God damn it. Oh, right there. Thank God. Alright there, that was fun, wasn't it? There's more maze. Why? Why is there more maze? Um. Oh, is, is, is that the doctor? Or is that one of the, the nurses or something? Ow! Hold on. 
on, birds. We got a coffee fucking thermos right here. Or something. Ah! Ooh, yeah. Alright, only have five bullets left. Please, can we get back to Barry? Like, right now. Or at least get some more ammo. I would like that very much. All right, shotgun's fine, I guess. There's one through. Oh, yeah, all right. Da, 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 da. Ow, mother trucker. Hold on. Ow, can you fucking not? Ah, Jesus! Couldn't even run away! Oh yeah, that's right, because you know, I lose breath every five seconds! I'm saving the revolver for you. Headshot! Hell yeah, son. Alright, let's get ourselves back to Barry. Can we please walk through this gate and just get back to Barry, please? God damn it! Ow! I don't care. I literally did not. Just shut up. Oh, here we go. Some light and some batteries and revolver ammo. Heck yeah. Oh, mother fucker. Ow. Very cool that they attack, you know, multiple times. Damn, they freaking go down in one shot now. Very nice. If only they didn't freaking attack multiple times. If only, you know, my character could run for more than freaking five seconds. I don't like that it keeps on bringing me to multiple freaking headlights. And also, this also looks like a boss fight area. Oh yeah, there's a lot of stuff going on here. Oh, Barry. you freaking... Barry. Hey! Yeah, I can't open this door. Can you open this gate? Maybe. Barry. Uh, well, I slammed it shut when the nasty showed up, and the key fits kind of loose in the lock, so, uh. Um. Um, Barry. You may want to hurry up on that. Oh, Jesus. Yeah, I, I kind of noticed that. I want to wait for them to get super close. And then I'm gonna drop a flare. Barry, I'm on it. I'm on it. Oh. Yeah. Ooh. Come on. Show yourself, bitch. Motherfucker! Hey, no throwing shit at me, alright? I love how these guys are just running towards the door. 
Don't worry, guys. Y you almost got Barry. Oh, fuck. Ow. A little too late for that, Barry. Pack, pack, I say. I can only imagine what that means. Come on, come on! Come on! <laughs> Are you fucking kidding me, Barry? Now is not the time. This character just got a million times more, li more likable. Jesus Christ, Barry. Come on, come on. Oh, motherfucker. Really gonna have all these. Yeah. Really gonna have all these fucking people show up. Ah! Okay, great. Fucking come on. Jesus. Ow. Please tell me we're headed for the nearest. Why do you have that? Come back soon, sign. We're going to the Anderson farm. I knew you were gonna say something like that. You know what? You owe me big time for this. When this is through, if we make it, I don't care what anybody says, I'm done with darkness. You're gonna buy me a tanning bed as a gift, and I'm gonna live in it. Um, I mean, you'd probably burn your body and hurt yourself, but sure, man, whatever you say. What is, is, is that the end of the episode? <laughs> no, it's only like 30 minutes in. I'm crazy, but that's fine, Mary. <laughs> oh, you got that right, Al. You're barking mad. You are by far the craziest... But maybe that's inevitable when you deal with crazy stuff like this. It helps. This is happening, Barry. Alice, they never had Alice. She's trapped in the darkness at the bottom of the lake, but she's not dead. Ow, how can you know that? I know, Barry, I can- Ow, I- No, listen, I can bring her back. I can find her. There's something special about this place. The lake, it, it does something to the works of art created here. It makes them come true. But there's a catch. The dark presence, whatever that thing is, twists it to its own ends. That's why all of this is happening. It's using my manuscript to take over every- Ow! I believe you! It happened to Thomas Zane before, it happened to the Andersons. I believe you! Crazy or not, you're not delusional. Weird shit's going down, that's a fact! I'm on board, man, I'm with you. The Andersons knew about it, but they were too far gone to tell me with all the drugs they were on. But they wrote it down. There's a message somewhere at their farm, Barry. We just need to find it. Look out! That was something. God damn it, I'll talk to me. I had lost my gun. I'm kind of hurt. Barry was nowhere to be seen. I mean, wasn't he just yelling out a few minutes ago? All right, okay, my, my health is back up. I'm fine now. Barry! Oh. Okay. I hit some bushes, didn't get a scratch. What? No way you can climb down though. It's like a sheer wall. Ah, Al, there's something moving down here. You sound Barry, very close. Use the flare, Barry. It's a taken. What the fuck does that mean? Oh, yeah. Barry, are you all right? <laughs> I'm good, Al. I'm great. Guess you never messed with anyone from New York City before, huh? Hey, <laughs> hey. Get back to Jersey, you morons! <laughs> that's a that's a quote from the movie Scrooged, a uh, very very famous Christmas film, one of the best. Barry, 
Hurry, just wait for me, okay? Ow! I'm not staying here! It's suicide! I'm going to the farm! I'm gonna go ahead and secure the area! You can catch up! Don't worry about it! I'm on the case! Okay. This would turn into a disaster if I didn't catch up with Barry. Yeah. What the fuck is going on here? I got no weapons, nothing. Now the ground is shaking. Very epic. Excuse me. Oh. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Hold on, hold on a second before anything happens. I gotta get. Th no, you will not get in the way of my thermos. Hell yeah. So, sorry, thanks, Barrel. Damn good cup of coffee. That's fucking great. Shout out to uh, that amazing reference to Twin Peaks. Obviously, yeah, this game reminds me a lot of Twin Peaks, because, you know, creepy town, mystery. That's really it. Oh, am I right back to where I started? Yeah. In hell. Ah! I was just about to say, I wonder if these things are going to come to life. Ow. Do I got to catch my breath? Yeah. Don't worry, these dangerous monsters won't come after me while I slowly jog. Are you kidding me? Oh yeah, I'm sure there's a light here somewhere. Like right over. Uh. Yeah, that's a manuscript. Here. What is that? Is it is, is that like all I can do over here? I got to turn the Very cool. Thank you. I could sense the movement in the woods ahead. There's a super strong freaking flashlight. I had no choice. I have no batteries. I gotta be careful. I got no wep- uh, I got no weapons! Uh, you, you, no! You can't! Please? Is there a gun over here I can use? Ow, mother- No! God, I gotta freaking get out of here! No! Oh shit. I did not want to do that. Ugh, oh, run. Heh, <laughs> you guys can't come after me. Ah! Yes you can. Mother- can you not throw shit? That just makes it so much easier for them to kill me! Ooh, that was a fucking epic dodge. Oh fucker! Uh, how, how am I going to freaking get past this? Come on. No. Oh, just kill me. Do it. Just do it. End my life. End my life, please. Do it. Come on, coward. Come on, coward. Do it. Good lord. Come on. Come on. Come on. 
Of course I'm out of fucking breath. Oh, fuck you. Come on! God damn it! You're fucking kidding me right now. How am I supposed to fight him? I don't have a gun. I have no fucking batteries. And they literally hit me every 10 seconds. Oh my god. You know, it, it's shit like this that's making me really dislike the game. I love this game so far. But having Alan constantly get out of breath. is And the enemies always being able to hit me every 10 seconds is, const is really pissing me off. Jesus Christ, I'm sorry for the rant. I, 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 for anyone that loves this game, I'm glad you love this game, but I greatly dislike this. Like, it's not even fun. It's not even It's not even funny anymore. It's... Same general direction as I was. Uh, please be Barry. Caught in the consequences of weeping before looking. Yeah? I freaking bet. Barry's a freaking hilarious badass. Or he's just weird. Either way, I heavily relate. Uh, is this the extra heavy bat? Uh, here we go. Come on. I can get the super extra heavy flashlight. Okay, batteries is great. Oh, thank God, coffee therm is good. Can I have a gun? A flare. Flare gun. No. Freaking epic. The car was heading for the cabin up ahead. It wasn't far. If it was Barry... I would see the damage soon. Woo! Oh, fuck. Fuck yeah, my guy. Hold on, we gotta catch breath? No? Oh. <gasps> Is it God? Is that you? Deliver each page to the right time and place. I'm trying to show you how the story goes. Who, who are you? Oh, it's, it's a page. I had seen it in my dream. It was a strange spaceman or a diver in a bulky suit. He was the one who'd been placing the pages on my path. Yeah, I got flares. What the... It's clearly a bear trap, but it's shining. I have no idea what's going on. Oh, okay, I guess it's a shining just to tell us. That they're here. Alright, cool. Bark, come on. Oh, oh, shotgun! Look at that! A weapon. Can I pick it up? A weapon. Gun behind. Now I had a fighting chance of reaching the farm. Yeah, thank fuck. Oh, oh, sweet baby Jesus. Mmm. Now I can actually fight. Hoorah! Oh, ow! I thought that was a manuscript. God, I'm stupid. Shay, I'm in the middle of recording. I cannot talk right now. Shay, please. I cannot. Ah, oh, fuck. Shay, please. Shut up. Page? Nope, not a page. Cool, I'm out of breath. Mother fucking god damn. Fuck you guys, I'm out of here. My cat, I love you so much, but you cannot do this right now. Maybe because they're in the house. Hello? Hello? Anybody here? Oh. <laughs> Barry! <laughs> no! Danny! You're not! Danny? What the hell is Danny? 
Hold on. Careful before. You need to get the thermos. The fuck? Are you, you okay, bear? And uh, very epic. Oh, I know you. You were in jail the other day. I went to the farm again. The moonshine, you know. Uh, where's Barry? See, they're they're not gonna miss it. They're in the loony bin. My buddy, Danny. I lost him. Something's gone wrong with him. It's not him. Okay. Like a real bad follow-up to a real... Yeah, it's great. Have fun. I've run through every possible course in my head. If I continue like the Dark Presence wants me to, the story I'm writing won't save Alice. It's a horror story, and it's going to kill her and me and everybody in this town. No one will survive. Darkness will consume everything. This is what uh -huh. I've wanted all along. It will be free. It used Alice to get to me, dangled yeah. her in front of me to keep yeah. her. It was never going to release her. I'm going to change this. I'll escape. I've written you'll, myself you'll a escape. story. I'm now the protagonist. This feels like a terrible risk, but it's the only way to save Alice. I'll be bound by the events of the story just as much as anyone else who's been woven into it. The story must stay true for this to work. There have to be victims along the way. Near escapes. Cliffhangers. In a horror story, it can't be certain that the hero will succeed or even survive. He almost has to die. I'll write my own escape into the story next. I need help. Zane's going to be the one who will help me. I'll make it happen. Okay. Can I answer the door now? Can I go back to a uh, crazy boy? Oh, he's he's just dead. Huh. Alright then. My ah, fam. Not right now. Ow, mother fucking screw you, dude. Let me guess. Danny, huh? What? <clears throat> was 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 that Danny? Door was locked. I literally go out. This room the door right here. Still a good distance away. I'd need a car to get there fast. Whoa, what's going on here? Oh Jesus, what the fuck? Right, just breathing, heavy breathing. Oh flare, flashbangs. Uh, it's weird heavy breathing. I don't like it. I'm gonna scan in my car. I'm getting a car. If Barry wasn't up here, he was probably in trouble down at the farm. For a moment, I felt bad for doubting him. After all, I'd made it this far myself. But Barry was Barry. What what does that mean? That, that doesn't make any sense. Great driving. Yeah. Uh-huh. Yep. Oh, yeah. Oh, look at that. Such epicness right there. Well, that sure is something. Mm. Hey, how you doing, buddy? Hold on a second. And you're dead. Man, wouldn't it be really funny if, like, the shadow people are just real people? And Alan is just brutally murdering and running over... Running over all these people? Alright, let's gotta continue on foot. If I can get through here. Oh man, not again. Oh, 
fucking finally, my guy. That was just annoying as fuck. Yeah, get out of here, bitch. You better hide, run and hide. Is this supposed to be the farm? I'm surprised there isn't a little sign that says the farm. Oh, wait. I'm supposed to go right here. Yeah. Eh. I'd known the brothers used to be some kind of rock stars. But it hadn't really sunk in until I saw this stage. Yeah. Ow! Run! They're coming! There's too many of them! Ah! What the fuck? Damn. <laughs> Barry, you badass! What's that? Shut up and shoot. What the hell was that? That was so quick, so pointless, so stupid, but I love it. Oh, Jeebus. Come on. Come on. Yeah. Yes. Here we go. Woo! Epic solo. No, damn it. God damn turn of the century wiring. Yeah, stupid. I'll get them working again. I promise. Ooh, heavy duty lantern. Oh, ow, motherfucker. All right. Come on. Ow, mother trucker. Nice. Come on, come closer, my friend. And bam. And say hello to Sally for me. Oh shit. Urgh. Yeah. You wanted to be fighting with Alan, fighting a bunch of dark shadow demons in a strange town while I'm being freaking shot at. Never mind, the, the, the joke's ruined. Heal myself up. Oh. Oh, did I do that? To be, I mean, I would not be surprised. Come on.
That was truly beautiful. Rock and roll capital of America. <laughs> this was one of the dumbest things I've ever seen, but you know what? I I love this game again. Thank you so much, Barry, for making me love this game again. So beautiful. That was. This way to the farm. Yeah, hold on. I'm trying. I'm just. I'm doing stuff. All right. That was phenomenal. I, I I am amazed at whatever the hell that was. Oh, do we have to jump over? Barry? What, what are you doing, buddy? Oh, we gotta go over here. Oh. The fuck? See, bestseller, no reason to worry. Your cutout's good as new, right where I left it. What do you mean? For it once we have the place secured. Yeah, that's been my biggest worry all this time. Yeah, right? We need to get this thing moved out of the way. <clears throat> Let me just fla flash this light in your eye. You sure, Barry? I'm flashing that light in your eye. Oh. Or what do I do? Oh boy, I gotta do some, uh, platforming. I'm just gonna go inside. I'm, I'm just, I'm just gonna leave Barry. You look at that thing, Al. They really went all out with this Viking crap, didn't they? I guess. I don't know. Look at all this stuff. They must have ah, TV. So oh, hello. Oh, it is? I didn't know Alan Wake was a part of that. Tonight's episode. The Dream of Dreams. Eh, that's by someone else. Oh, alright. We join Mr. Jim Seeks in his dreamscape. Only to be brought to a city. Barry, are you gonna help or are you just gonna freaking stand there and just watch TV? You know what? I do the same thing too. Manuscript. The Viking boat looked imposing, almost like a battering ram. Wow. What a what a winky dink. Darkness. Oh, I'm, do I gotta breathe? Yeah, I gotta breathe. Okay, okay, I'm good now. Oh, motherfucker. Oh, cool. Fam, you guys are fast! Fucking Barry, can you not just watch TV right now? I was in the middle of a freaking shootout. Oh god, and I'm still in a shootout. Alright, never mind. I'm not, now I'm no longer in a shootout. I was in a shootout before, Barry, and you're just freaking staring there watching TV. Oh, Barry? Barry? What the fuck did he go? Oh. Is he, is he stuck there? Yeah, it looks like he was stuck there. Yeah. 
kind of sucks for you guy. Sorry. I think we can make it through here, Al. What the fuck are you talking about, Barry? Where are you, Barry? What's the point of this? Okay. Um, alright. Oh, mother... Ah! Another trucker. Yeah! Woo! Hold on, I think I got a manuscript over here. No, well, that's just something shiny. All right, Barry, where are you? All right, we're at that time where I'm... Oh, there we are. There you are, buddy. How you doing, pal? All right, Barry and Alan solving mysteries together. Wow, those geezers had quite a production going on. Damn. You know what, Al? Gee willikers. I'm going to start representing them. Yep, sell this stuff online, maybe get a reality show going, release a new single. Good luck with that, pal. What? Hey, you find us a way out of here, okay? Ren, you're just freaking out over this shit, and now you're just like, oh my god, look at that really cool thing that they used to farm. Careful, Al! I mean, fine. Literally nothing bad is going to happen to me. I'm the main character. I have a sequel. I don't remember you... You're hearing about you being in the sequel. You could be, but I don't know. I didn't bother to read that, so I don't know if you're going to be fine. Fucking... Bro. Not nice. I'm good. Keep your eyes open, okay? Oh my god, I found what I was looking for. Thermos. Alright, I'm good now. I'm heading back downstairs. Oh, okay. All right, I get it. I gotta go all the way up, all the way to the top. Just find a way to open the silo. I'm at the top yet? I'm at the top. Oh my god, I'm not at the top yet. Am I at the top yet? Oh, I see something. That, oh, that's a radio. As you regular listeners know, I tend to work through the night. Oh my god, I still got stairs to go up. Kind of want to hear it. Deer Fest is almost here, isn't it? I bet that keeps you in business. Pretty busy, yeah. Actually, Pat, we've been real busy with other stuff. Which concerns an ongoing investigation. We can't talk about that, Thornton. I wasn't going to say anything. I was just saying we got, you know, other irons to fry. And how would you compare your workload to last year? Things have seemed relatively peaceful to me, but people do tend to get a little wild this time of year. Oh, it's wild, Pat. It's pretty wild. There's been all sorts of trouble this year. Vandalism, fighting, public disturbances. A lot of people gone missing, too. Yeah, yeah, it's, it's pretty much the uh, usual stuff, Pat. Uh, just, you know, uh, a lot more of it. Now, is it just me, or does Deerfest get wilder every year? People seem to be more drunk, at least, or they start earlier. And younger. Oh, it's definitely not just you, Pat, but definitely, Pat. Hey, I'm talking here. Uh, hey, I'm walking here. Oh. Very cool. All right. Me. Oh. It wasn't far now. I wasn't worried about trusting the ramblings of two burned-out geriatric wrecks. They had the goods. 
All right. Where do I uh, open the door for bear? Oh. Ah! Just gotta get some stuff here. Uh huh. Uh huh. No, I'm good. I'm good on everything else. All right. Epic. Oh no! Is this thing gonna come to life? I literally. Mm. Oh, thank God. I was not going to be dealing with that for like. Oh, shit. Die, buddy. Come on. Ah, oh, thank you for patiently waiting. And have a good day. Or night. I don't really care. Where's... Oh, thank you. For that information. Now I know more. Thank you, demon farmer. Very cool, thanks. Right in the butthole. Open the silo door for Barry. How do I, how do, I do that? Oh, over here. Is there a button here that says open door? Yep, ba doop, ba doop, ba da 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 da, ba da ba do. Epic jump down. Ooh, it hurt, but it was worth it. Oh, great. Love the flashing lights. Oh, my eyes. Oh, wait. Uh, Al? Is that you out there, buddy? Yeah, it's me. Hi. Wow. Hey, let's go, man. Yeah. Al and Barry teaming up together, fighting crime and solving mysteries. Barry's got a cool red jacket on, and he has a shirt that looks like he's from Miami. He's walking towards me because he understands a friendship. Me and Barry are super cool together. We stare in each other's eyes. And we're friends, and we're totally not gay. Woo! I think we're gonna have to work together to open this gate out. Yeah, look at that. Work together. Uh, that, that, was, that, was, that was literally me. Never, never would have guessed that. Damn. I mean, why Barry? Barry's not crazy. He's just kind of a weirdo. Yeah, okay. are we gonna have to push again? Come on, one more gig. I got it. It's, it's literally just me that's doing it. I'm sorry. Oh my god, please somebody can pick up the chainsaw. Urgh, I really hope I can pick up the chainsaw. Old gods know the truth. <gasps> so is Odin and Tor? Are they really gods? That'd be cool. That would also be a really nice tie-in for the Marvel Cinematic Universe. Wow, what a shock. Never would have guessed that. Thanks, Barry. Barry, you know what? You're actually a really big help. Thank you, Barry. Thank you very so fucking much. I'm sorry, Barry. I didn't mean to be rude. I'm, I'm, I'm just having a very stressful time um, right now because I'm almost an hour and 20 in. And I have no idea when this is going to end. In here? Hey, coffee thermos. Alright. Uh, Asgard. Old yeah. God. I don't think they breathing. keep too close an eye on them at the clinic. They seem to slip away a lot so they can get wasted. No kidding. Those guys sound awesome. They also sound violent because they kind of knocked out a woman. What the hell is all the fuse boxes in here? Poof! This is really nerve, 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 nerve. nerve. Can 
Yeah, I heard the shotgun. Need to find where it's coming from. That's the whole reason we're here. Oh, the record player, really? That's gotta be what's your face, the crazy lamp lady from the town. Cynthia Weaver. Right. Must be. Yo. What am I doing? What am I doing? What a beautiful song. So nice. What a nice song. We need to find Cynthia Weaver. We'll stay here for the night and head back to town as soon as it gets light. Hey, Al. Lots of hours before dawn. Might as well get some rest. And by rest, I mean drunk. Come Are those even beer bottles? Yeah. What the hell? <laughs> I mean, might as well. We don't get along. We're best friends. I'm gonna stick by you, no matter what, ever, Al. Sure, like brother. I'm a Aww. God damn it. Correct. <laughs> oh no. I could write ten books a year. Mmm. And and they'd be the best books that year. Oh fuck. Yeah, Barry, right. shut up. But I could, cause I'm a writer. All right, you, yeah. What do they put in this stuff? I feel like my brain is coming out of my nose. That's because your brain is in your nose. Who's <laughs> be a, a, a booze millionaire? Oh my God! Ra ra round round of applause. I just want her here with me. I want to make sweet love to Alice. It's gonna be okay. We're gonna make it okay. Maybe I'll be your Alice, Alan. Ha 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 ha. Let me guess, the real villain is going to be that cardboard cutout. Of course, Barry falls asleep on the floor. Poor Barry. This guy deserves so much better. <gasps> Wait a minute. Alan Wake. What the fuck? Am I in the astral plane? <laughs> I'm dreaming again. Ugh. Okay. Alice! Alice! Where are you? Alice! I'm coming! It's all right! I'm coming! It was a crazy drunken dream. And yet, it was more than that. It was the truth. A suppressed memory unearthed by the Anderson's moonshine. Uh oh. Was there, an out-of-body observer. This so can I, like, phase through? The bright falls. The night Alice had disappeared. I had a chance to find out what had happened. Let me guess, it was you? Surprised to see the cabin dark. Alice would have never turned the lights off. Alice? Alice! But yeah, because the power went out. Unless you put the power out. <gasps> I remembered thinking I caught a glimpse of her form underwater. And you were like, oh no! Remember that, guys? Diving after her was the last vague memory I had of that night. Yeah. After that, the next thing I could remember was waking up behind the wheel of the crash car and finding the first pages of the manuscript. I couldn't find her in all that blackness. I must have thought she drowned. Alice. Jagger had Alice, Alice, and so she had me. What? Alice. Oh, yeah, the woman. <laughs> All right. I'd been easy. For oh. Look at the cabin. Is there someone in the window? Where? Maybe she didn't drown after all. What? Maybe she's inside. Alice! Yes. Ah! Gotta run, gotta run, gotta run, 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 in the house. 
Look how fast my spirit is going. Dark presence had touched me. She had dug Ooh. nails into my brain and you made me her puppet. It's kind of gross, my guy. Are we gonna? F oh, hello, lady. She must be here somewhere. Maybe upstairs in the study. Alice. Maybe. Yes, that's where she is. <laughs> you can apologize. Oh, I get what this all is. This is all just being angry at her. If you weren't so angry at Alice, this never would have happened. Alice? She's not here. You were foolish to think so. No, she's dead. She drowned. Uh. Uh. No, no, no! It's now write a book. Your wife is dead. You are guilty. All she wanted was to help you write. You killed her. You selfish bastard. Now go right. Now no, go right. Cauldron Lake is a special place. Here, you have the power to change things. She wanted you to write. I will tell you what to do. Uh, okay, I, I was gonna have you grab my hand, but you I guess not. Get her back. The story will come true, and all will be well again. She had Alice, and the manuscript was the ransom for her. Yeah. Let me just slightly touch your shoulder. All right. I'll fix it. I'll bring her back. Good. Now he can. Oh my god. No. I wrote it. Uh, I remembered it all now. I wrote the manuscripts that I wrote. A week. Almost a complete manuscript of a novel entitled Departure. <gasps> Jagger had been Let me guess, is that what the last chapter is going to be called? The unfolding story would make her more and more powerful. I thought I was saving Alice. Even with the cobweb she put in my head, some part of me had been aware enough to write my escape into the story. To bring a light into the cabin to release me before I could finish. To interrupt the horror story before the ending, where darkness consumed everything and everyone. Zane was weak and far away, but I had written him into the story and his light had been enough to set me free. It is the year now. I'm here because it was written. I brought the light to set you free. You must hurry, or know I will hear. It will be back soon. She stole the skin of my heart a long time ago. She looks so old. What the shit? I had woken up, confused and groggy. My mind consumed by darkness and fear. All I could do was to escape. The week spent in the cabin had taken its toll. I was barely conscious and fading fast. It had to have cost Zane terribly, thrown him even deeper into whatever dark place he now haunted. But he had managed to weaken the dark presence, kept me safe that night. Oh yeah! That's right, James Joyce. It's your fault, and you're gonna pay for it. <gasps> oh my God! Uh, oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Yep. Copyrighted music. Okay. That was episode four. The truth. I already forgot the name of it. I'm gonna assume that the last episode is gonna be called Departure or whatever the title of. He named his book when he was writing while he was, you know, all cummed up. I guessed that it was really him that wrote the novel while he was, you know, during the week of his, uh, unknown amnesia or whatever to say it. Um, once again, the, I, I really, obviously there's nothing, 
that I can do about my complaining about his uh, running out of breath every few seconds. It's not like, you know, me complaining will automatically change it and make it better. You know, there's nothing I can do. It's, it's just super annoying, and it, it's the lead cause to a lot of my deaths uh, in this game is when, you know, I'm trying to run, and Alan runs out of breath really quick, and then the enemies just hit me three or four times in a row without even me giving the sl like the the running and dodging thing is total bullshit half the time and that's also annoying but freaking Barry and his crazy light show saved the entire episode and probably the game for me because I was getting really mad at the game for you know before but then the whole crazy light show happened and that that was just undoubtedly one of the weirdest dumbest and funnest uh, things I've seen in a game in a while. So, thank you for that, Barry, you crazy man. And uh, I'll be seeing you guys next time in the final episode where we are in the endgame. Bye.